We just conducted an evacuation of our clients from Haiti into the Dominican Republic. It was a really challenging mission with a lot of elements to account for, including the security situation itself, as well as diplomatic hurdles. This was a really precarious situation for our clients. And with respect to escalations in Haiti, it was uh, unique for some reasons. The first would be that the gang activity was taking place within and near some of the mountainside communities that are typically less affected, places like Pétionville and nearby communities where clients and uh, international organizations typically operate. Beyond that, road travel through much of the city and outside of Port-au-Prince certainly was not feasible. This was due to roadblocks, uh, roadside banditry, looting, and, and threats of that nature. And lastly, the uh, airport uh, in, in Port-au-Prince, uh, Toussaint Louverture International Airport, uh, although it was operational and in the hands of the authorities for the most part, in spite of some attacks that had taken place previously, uh, flights were not operating. Finding legitimate, capable, licensed, and insured rotary wing operators to support the evacuation operations from Haiti was extremely challenging. Fortunately, Exlog Global enabled that capability, including pre-positioning the airframe from the U.S. into the Dominican Republic and securing the helicopter landing zone. Once we got that final approval, it was all systems go. It was like a mini mission control within our incident management team room. We called air traffic control to ensure that the flight plans had been filed and approved. Our security team notified our local ground security partner in Haiti to pick up the clients and drop them off at the helicopter landing zone. All 16 passengers were loaded into the helicopter with the help and coordination of our ground security partner. So while members of our team coordinated the Haitian side, I contacted the airport in the Dominican Republic to form a reception team to ensure that when they landed, they'd be given immediate medical attention, food and water. A key to the success of this mission was bringing to bear the unique strengths and capabilities of International SOS and Exlog Global. That collaboration allowed us to plan and execute a very challenging evacuation mission that included several elements that all needed to work together for the mission to be successful. We had a direct, complicated and multi-segment ground transportation missions in order to make sure that all of our evacuees made it safely to the evacuee assembly area as well as to the helicopter landing zone. All of this was done with the written authorizations and approvals from the respective ministries of foreign affairs and civil aviation authorities. You know, we're really proud to support our clients who do important work in Haiti. And I think it's a testament to the faith that they place in us, that they engage with us and rely on our support uh, in as serious an escalation as this one.